Thanks for logging on to WCBI.com. I'm meteorologist Jacob Dickey. Tonight, things are looking great out there. Temperatures falling into the low 70s under a mostly clear sky. I've got 71 in Macon and in Columbus. West Point also down to 71. We'll get down to 73 in Amory and in Tupelo overnight tonight. For our Sunday then, things look dry for the most part and we'll call it mostly sunny, maybe partly cloudy if we're north of I-22. And if there is a sprinkle anywhere in the viewing area tomorrow, it will be for folks close to the Tennessee border as maybe a sprinkle comes from the remnants of what was Tropical Storm Florence. That though, the odds are very low. I think we're going to enjoy a great Sunday for us across the entire area. Here's our day planner for Sunday. Things will warm up quickly back into the 90s, but it will feel a little drier out there. We don't get nearly as much tropical moisture, so it, it will be warm in the sun outside, but you can definitely go outside and enjoy things if you're in the shade or really uh, in, in the late morning hours and, and through the evening. Look for those temperatures to get into the low 90s by afternoon. We'll call it 92 in Tupelo and in Avery, 91 in Houston, Pontotoc, 89, 89 also in Oxford, Iuka and Boonville at 91 and 90 respectively. Into the Golden Triangle, Columbus 93, West Point 93, 92 in Louisville, 95 in Macon with northwest winds 5 to 10 miles an hour and mostly sunny skies. The same for Solajit 91, Vernon 91, Reform will get to 92 for our Sunday afternoon high. There goes Florence, or what we call the remnants of it there, as it gets lifted off to the north and to the east. We'll be on the back side of it. That's why our winds are bringing in drier air from the north and to the west. As we get to the middle of the week, though, the center of high pressure starts to slide to our east. That's going to give us a better chance for some of those pop-up showers and storms later in the week. Something we will be watching in the coming five to seven days, though, is down in the Gulf, we've got what is the remnants of Tropical Storm Isaac. It was a tropical storm east of the U.S. Virgin Islands. It has dissipated, but has a 20% chance of developing over the next five days as that area moves off to the west and to the north. We'll keep our eyes on it. Odds are very low to see any develop out of it as of now. As we look at our seven-day forecast locally, really warm for what we should be this time of year by five to 10 degrees in spots. We'll call it mostly sunny through the middle of the week with the chance for an isolated shower Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. By Friday and Saturday, we think we may get a cold front to slide on in. That'll up our chances to perhaps some isolated to scattered showers and storms into the afternoon hours. But overall, over the next seven days, things looking very dry in our area.